thing on. Hello. Like the Hello. Grand, the grandparents when they first learned to FaceTime. Yeah. Are like, you in there? Don't tap it too hard. <laughs> it took us an hour. Okay. So I'm like, why don't I get Morgan? Be sliding. We do be sliding. Listen, it took us forever to get this thing set up because I have wore the phone. What do you even call this? I it's have like wore, a joint ball. It holds, this thing holds your phone. Situation. This thing holds your phone and this on the window. Is malfunctioning. And I have wore it out. Like I've literally videoed so much that like all of the joints are, what would you say? They're just like crippled. Like they woed out. They are. It, it, it has degenerative joint disease. Yeah. So now that my phone holder has DJD, um, we have had to like completely rig it together in the most redneck ingenuitive way. But lucky for us, I'm like trying not to hit any of the bumps hard. But I have I a master's can't... degree in inge redneck ingenuity. Redneck it? ingenuity. ingenuity. Mm -hmm. That's what I. That's what I'm wearing. If y'all saw it, you'd be super proud of us. You would. We've done a lot of things in the past 24 hours that we just made work. We the just chalkboard. Made work. We couldn't find a dustpan. No. We found a chalkboard. The, it, which also, it was a dustpan and a dog and a gate. Ramp. Yeah, it was a dog gate. Now that chalkboard, my dogs. Listen, my dogs are just really nervous about the fact that we just we're. To be real, I'm always moving and I'm always in new places. And recently they've had a home in Proctor, Arkansas, and they've been very comfortable at, uh, at my boss's. And I moved here and, you know, came here and they're just super not understanding that they don't have to escape from Tara's backyard, that it's actually like a puppy paradise on the real. When I tell you they have a sunroom that they go in and out of with an AC unit in it, and these these bitches are still trying to dig out the fence like a couple of rednecks. I don't understand. I know. Well, they're just they're like, Mom, where are you going? They think I'm But my forever. dogs, so both of my dogs, Bear and Violet, are like, hey, we have AC. Hey, Y'all can stay here. You ain't got to get out and run the streets. My dogs are just being hood rats. And they're like, hey, And my neighbor. dogs are like, hey, we have two beds. We share. Because Bear and Violet always lay on the big one together. They're like, y'all can have the other one. And my dogs are like, where's my mother? Anarchy. We don't do fences. Yeah. You cannot put us in a fence. And my dogs are like, we really like the city life. We've gained a lot of weight. Violet's like so fat. She's like, can you loosen my collar a little? She mad thick. She mad thick. Mad thick. The thickness is a sickness. It's a sickness. It yeah. Is. So for those of you who don't know, um, y'all are watching. And this is Morgan. Hey. Morgan is new here. She's new to me. New Not to really. Me. Morgan's been my friend Probably for a while. Probably you got me in on trade or something. Yeah. New to me. I took this one in on trade. Um, I'm going to keep it a while. I'm going to go ahead and tune it up and keep it around a little while. Morgan is going to come and help me run my business. She is my literal right hand woman. Hit the wave. Hit the wave. <laughs> Y'all can't see that, but it happened. Look at my broodmare's <laughs> in my stud. The broodmare's in my stud right there. So... Um, I'm super excited. We're actually going to go grab some Gatorades because it's over 100 degrees here. Today. This girl tried not to feed me. And, like, I didn't, we were doing a podcast and I was kind of like looking at her and we I was did like, I want to flag her down and be like, hey, don't forget food. Don't forget to feed me before feed you work the me. shit out of me. And yeah, we got to the pins and I was like, hey, you still didn't feed me. So, just so you guys know, for the 60 some interview, I'm going to do a giveaway. Um, Morgan and I are going to do a video when we get out to the pins on the girts that I use. But I have a five-star girt that came on a saddle I bought. It's beautiful, and I don't use five-star girts. So I'm going to give it away to somebody. So all you have to do is like this video and share it. And just hit like and hit share. And if you like it and you share it, you get you get in. We'll just randomly pick somebody. Yeah. Um, what's a week from today? No, that one's just, it's a five star. It's like $150. It's like, um, it's turquoise and purple and black. I'll take a picture of it. But I use cinches that look like English skirts. So that's a whole other thing. We'll talk about that probably today when we saddle some horses. Um, we're fixing to evaluate a bunch of horses from the kill pen. A bunch. Yeah. A bunch. So... Anyway, if you guys will just kind of hang on and come back. Stick around. We'll be here all day. If you're interested in the horses I'm that we evaluate. <laughs> <laughs> I'm 
I'm like, um, I'm like, I can't wink. So you I'm, can't physically. Like, if you were gonna wink, which eye would it be? This one. All right, now look into the camera and wink. Hit him with it. Mm. <laughs> my, my mom used to tell me when I was little. She tried to teach me. My mom taught me. And my mother Shout would be out, like, mom. my mother would be like, um, good job. Been stealing men's souls for years because my mom taught me how to wink. Not with a wink. I realize I'm not that beautiful, but just know when my eyelashes are on, honey. When I paint these blonde things, that wink. I can get so, whatever I need. Yeah, and I think that's so funny. <laughs> so yeah, me, I'm, I'm like, I cannot wink. I, I have to like open my don't mouth. Work on it. Can't. I don't believe that. I just don't. I just like show a little leg. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I just shake pop, a little. Pop lock. <laughs> hey, you look back on it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I just pop lock and drop it. You know. I ain't got a wink. Quit playing. You know, thirty year old knees don't pop and lock. Oh knees, yeah. Your knees oh, allow yeah. that. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. I don't get down in that. My position 30, so almost 34 year old knees will like still drop it like uh -uh. it's hot. Uh -uh. Mm -hmm. See, I'm not happy. In the boots with the spurs. Mm -mm. Yeah. No. Get it? Mm -mm. Instead of boots with spurs. <laughs> See what I did there? <laughs> hey. hey. No. So, okay. So, seriously, um, I will post photographs of everything that we evaluate here along with a link to where they are actually videoed, which is going to be on um, Thompson Livestock Co. That's here on Facebook. So, Morgan and I have a podcast. We, it cut off at 45 minutes for some reason. We got to I rambling. don't know where it cut off, but we'll do a part two this evening. Uh, just just know we have enough words to just, like, last a lifetime. So Somebody told me that they, that they saw my podcast pop up on Spotify. So, if you have Spotify, it's called The Horse Trader's Diary. Episode one is just me by myself. Episode two is us rambling. We don't know where it cut off. I will go back, listen to the end of it figure out where it cut off and we will we'll try to catch up we'll catch up there this evening because we can talk for hours so you can go to spotify look up the horse traders diary it is a podcast um i don't know if it's on apple or not i know that i can pay like 99 cents an episode to have it on there and i will do that because i'm not doing it for the money they did tell me however that my first podcast had had enough listeners that i can monetize it okay then so, if you haven't heard my podcast, it is The Horse Trader's Diary. There's two episodes so far. Um, but, again, we will have a third episode up. And, listen, if you haven't tuned into that, that's a great way to catch us, like, super-duper candid. Like, I know yeah, you think it's not. That it's super, it's super inappropriate. Yeah. Like, I want you to know we talk about, yeah. I mean, I said vagina, yeah. penis, balls. Oh, yeah. All the stuff and things. All the like, stuff and things were said. So, um, it's super candid and it's a lot of us on the road going places. We do podcasts when we're on the road because it's better than like trying to do this when we're driving places that are not just in right. town. Um, we are going to video horses today. It's 111 degrees here. Just know that we, we really care. We, we care. care. <laughs> I'm about to go sweat our asses off. It would take a lot of sweating mm -hmm. to sweat these off. They will remain. Mm -hmm. The ass will prevail. Yeah. <laughs> It will make it through today. It'll make it through today. <laughs> but just make sure that you like sh like this video and share it. You do have to share it. Um, just just share it. Free girth. Free girth. Five star girth. It's a five it star. It can be yours. It can be yours. For the one time. Low price of. Free. Yeah. A on share. I can share. Yeah, it just came on a saddle. And it's like a really good quality girth. That's why I'm giving it away. Because I feel like I stand behind it. Like I would love for somebody to own it. My issue is I just don't do mohair cinches at all. But it's like a great cinch. I would love for anybody to have it. I just prefer, because we ride so many horses, I prefer the ones that have the elastic because it has eliminated all of my, um, like, cinchy horse issues. Right. Like, they don't get cold backed anymore because you never gird them up to where they can't breathe. Right. So, I just don't do mohair. I don't do, like, neoprene. Right. I love the cinches that I've bought. Like, I love them. We'll introduce you to them today. I did a couple of years ago. Did a video on them. We'll do a new one today. For sure. Mm -hmm. So, make sure you like this. You share it. Anything you want to add? We'll see y'all shortly. Great. Bye. We're going to eat. Bye.